Hey guys, how is it going? Welcome back to another video on our new account series. So today is day number 45. So it's been like one and a half month already and I have made some really good progress. This video is going to be an interesting one because there are there have been a lot of changes, uh, especially in my roster, uh, you know, so which I'm going to show you. All right, guys, so before we proceed in the video, I just wanted to let you know that if you are new to the channel and if you are watching this video for the first time, I would like to ask you to please hit the subscribe button and click on the bell notification for further updates on videos just like this. All right, guys, so I haven't played a single fight in the arena today and still I am on Elite 4. And I was on Untouchable, obviously, then I did not play for like uh, 14, 15 hours in the arena, but... I'm going to play it maybe on the stream. Uh, so basically, if you haven't really subscribed to my streaming channel, I've left the link to that channel down in the description. So just go and take a look at the streaming channel. If you enjoy streaming, especially Injustice 2 Mobile, then please do give it a look, give it a subscribe and uh, join my stream. So basically, I stream at around 4.30 Indian, Indian Standard Time, 4.30 p.m., not in the morning, in the afternoons. All right, guys. So... Uh, yeah, I think uh, I haven't really done much in the arena, so there is nothing much to talk about over here. So, let's move on. Alright guys, so we have a new solo raid, which is the most annoying solo raids ever created by Injustice 2. It's Dawn of Apocalypse. And it's going to be there for like five days only, out of which one day is almost done. So, I have finished off all these sub-bosses over here. And I have to fight uh, boss Suicide Squad Harley Quinn. She's also not having a lot of health left. Thanks to King of Atlantis Aquaman that I was able to finish off all these sub-bosses so easily. Uh, basically, I did a one-shot on all these sub-bosses. And I did this damage with two pips. Uh, no, I'm sorry. With one pip. With one pip is already left. So I might finish off uh, Harley Quinn in just one pip. Uh, let's hope it's possible. She is having a bit of defensive modifiers like she cannot be stunned. And there's power fluctuation and stuff like that. Uh, so, uh, yeah, you know, let's hope that this goes fine. This goes great. Uh, because I'm really looking forward to getting those additional gems. And uh, I basically spent my, all, all of my gems for the LOA chest opening, which I uploaded like a few hours, a couple of hours ago. I'm sure you guys might have seen it. If you haven't seen it, uh, you guys can just go and take a look at it in my on my channel. You know, I'll also leave the link. Not link exactly. I've leave the, leave the video at the end of this video in the end screen for you guys to watch. All right, guys. So you can watch it on the playlist called as Pack Openings. All right, guys. So, uh, yeah, I mean, you know, it will probably take me one pip and let's see what rewards I get after defeating this cat. It will be a three-star gold hero and 250 gems. Not bad. Uh, not bad at all. All right, guys. Now, moving on. Uh, moving on to Champions Arena. So we still have two days left for the season to end. It's not a lot of time left. Okay, so I've I've gone down to rank 25. I need to play a few more fights over here. Uh, so I think the least amount of rank it is, it's 40. So I need to be under rank 40 to get myself promoted to the next division. Which will happen, I think. You know, because I'm going to play only my second account on today's stream. And try to get myself as high as possible. And in, in the rankings, both in the arena and champions arena. So uh, again, I haven't played it today. Uh, I will play it in the during the live stream. All right, guys. Now moving on. Uh, moving on to the store. Now there is this chest available in the store, which is called as Joker League of Anarchy Hero Chest, and the same thing is there for the gears for this particular team. Now, the good thing about this gear chest is that only they will give you the gears for the LOA characters. No no gears apart from that. It's from outside, you know. Uh, so, I, I think if you are a beginner and I think if you are looking for getting these LOA characters or their gears, this is probably the best chest that you can invest your gems in. So, I would say just go and drop all your gems on this chest. If you are a beginner, if you need these characters, only then. Uh, if, you are in, uh, if you are a player who have already got all these characters, then obviously there is no point. Alright, and apart from that, there is this Fury of God's uh, Shazam Legendary Chest still there in the in the store. Again, if you it's it's your choice. It's a decent legendary character, not like the awesome legendary character category. It's a decent character if you want go, if you want you can go for it, go for him too. If you don't have anything else to build. Uh, Alright, guys. So I guess that is about it for the store. Now let's move on into the daily objective and the achievements. Now, as I haven't really played long played in this for a long time, like in the past 24 hours. So let's take a look at the achievements. 
uh yeah i mean it's it's going to be pretty much the same like you saw it uh, in the last video as you can see okay daily objectives 17 more battles and i'll get another 200 gems so that should be good all right guys now finally at the end let's jump into the roster there are a lot of things that i want to show you guys let's shatter the duplicate gears yeah i don't uh, it doesn't matter if i shatter these duplicate gears because okay let's start off with heartbreaker harley quinn so this is one character that i unlocked and i just did not unlock the character i have also unlocked a level 30 gear and a level 5 gear so this is going to be insane guys this is definitely going to be insane okay let's level her up i'm going to use my entire team loe team in the arena which gives me an additional team for playing in the arena and it will give me more points okay let's see if i have some experience capsules over here to use yes i do it's not a lot but I think it's still going to help me out. <clears throat> okay. Let's unlock the talents. That's a nice talent. 12% chance to armor pierce on basic attacks. That's not bad. Resistance. Block effectiveness is something that I don't need. Okay. I guess I'll just keep it for now. All right. All right. So I've upgraded the abilities. Let me upgrade this, not this one. You know what? This is about it for Harley Quinn. Let's move on to the Joker. The Joker. I have three gears for the Joker. And I think what, two of them are at level 30. I don't know. At least one should be at level 30. Okay, one is at 10. And I think the jacket is at level 30. Yes. Okay. So create the passives real quick. Now I cannot upgrade the level of the character for now, but I'm going to do that later on. Let's unlock the talents as well. Okay, common talent. Okay, that's nice. Armor piercing is definitely nice on Last Love the Joker. Okay, this works too. All right, guys. So I guess that is going to be it because I don't have enough resources right now to upgrade EPI. I'll just, you know, where is she? There she is. And I'll just put on the one gear that I got for EPI. All right, guys, I guess that is it for the video. You know, if you enjoyed it, give it a like and let's meet again in the next video. Until then, guys, have a great day. Take care of yourselves. Be blessed and stay safe. Have a good one, guys. Bye-bye.